everyone, welcome back to Pathfinder Kingmaker. Um, so where are we again? Oh, yeah, we're at this camp. So we're one step closer of uh, getting down, well, killing... I wonder if I can get in his pants. Alright, uh, we're, we're one step closer to getting closer to defeating the Stag Lord. We've already helped the Nymph, so... Are you serious? Okay, if I go... Hmm... If I go this way... Or if I go this way... Yeah, I can just cut... A, can I cut across this way? It looks like I can. All right, we got the we got the wedding ring too for uh Svatlana. Svatlana, Svatlana. Oh. Fresh bread. I can't believe it. All this time we sat in cages and crawled in mud. There were places in the world where they were breaking fresh bread. And here we are. I bet they have clean sheets. Maybe we can take a bath. Ha <laughs> ha, girl can dream. Go get some rest. You deserve it. Now, go get some rest. You deserve it. You can be sure of that. I got years to ca for us to catch up on. And I'll be stuffing my face until I turn into a ball. You do so much for us. Is it because you're kind or maybe you're charmed by my beauty? Uh, what? 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 Uh... What the are you asking? We're friends! Yes. Thank you. Alright, enough talk. Fresh bread and clean sheets await. Yes, we're we're friends. We're friends. I don't know if I want to sleep with any of these people. You know, I have my husband back at the winery and well, he's he's dead now. The dangers don't frighten me. Okay. Hello Oh I is there a problem? Listen, there's, well, since you dispatched the bandits with such skill, maybe you can help us with another problem. Oh, of course, Oleg. What can I help you with? There's a feral slime living in the woods. Not a normal wild pig. We're talking about a vicious boar. As big as a bear and as wicked as a devil. The locals call him Tusk Gutter. Many hunters have lost life and limb to him. Vakel Be Benzen found the slayer and went to kill the beast, but came back with one leg. He put a bounty on the boar's head, but it looks like there aren't any heroes bold enough to claim it. Maybe you were... Oh, I, I think that's a good idea. Right, Miri? Hey, we're better than local wussies, right? Wanna bet I can chop off this tusk gutter snout with a single swing? Let's find out. Alright, let's go kill this tusk gutter. Right, that's the way. I like it. Let's do it. I'll share my Alright, so we have new people. Uh does anybody have anything new to share? Oh, hi Tristan. Greetings! May this humble chosen of the Great Serenary help you. Tell me about yourself. Uh, about myself, I wouldn't know where to begin. You know my name, my faith, I follow Serenary. I've traveled from the Padishah Emperor of Kalesh to here. What else do you want to know? You don't strike me? Oh, uh, forgive me? Uh, you don't look like a Kaleshite? Oh, you have nothing to apologize for. I received my name and appearance from my parents. Who come from Kalesh from afar. I never knew them for the f for the fate had separated us when I was young. So I grew up in Kalesh, raised by the followers of Saturnary. My home is where my heart is, within the temples of the great goddess, among the wise and generous men that took it upon themselves to care for it, of a child that is so unlike them. I learned mercy and patience at an early age. And it is these virtues that have made me the man I am today. Do you enjoy the traveling? Oh yes, no library and no archive, however large, would ever allow me to learn so much of the world as in my journeys. It was only outside the temple walls I realized every living being in it is a world unto themselves. A world where many contradictions and passions coexist. Uh, do you know where you're gonna go next? No, my thoughts are far from it, for my mission is not yet done. Why do you ask? Do you wish me to land? No, 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 you are my comrade at arms. I trust you completely. Thank you. I'm pleased to be of assistance. Doesn't uh, being outside the temple make you uncomfortable? There are many ways to honor one's god, Eleanor. 
It is true shrines play a role in many in lives of many faithful, but there are even more ways to serve Saren Ray. The healing light values good deeds above all else. I cannot stand by and watch evil claim others. Perhaps that is the other reason why I choose to go on my pilgrimage, leaving the temples behind. Can you tell me about Saren Ray? I do not know much of the healing goddess. Uh, Saren Ray is the goddess of temperance and patience. Solar flame goddess teaches us compassion for the weary and mercy to those who go astray. What would you like to know? Uh, how is she worshipped? Many worship the solar frame goddess in our temples. Some make pilgrimage to the Everlight Oasis. But even those who do not serve the goddess directly really shun the festivities dedicated to her. Okay, um... I should go. Oh, you call yourself a, a chosen of Saren Lei. What do you mean by that? Oh, sorry, that was a mere jest. Other acolytes at my temple used to tease me with that title. This should be tell you how pious and devoted I was compared to. Oh, we got a lot of pri a little prideful dude here. And yet my faith is strong. Sarah Ray knows this and protects me in times of great peril. If something ever threatens my life or divine powers, I am transported to a safe location. Okay. Hello. How may I serve you? Um, I found the temple of the elk, and we killed the beast there. Erast, you be praised. You finally returned, my good friend. Christian told me how you helped him at the Temple of the Elk. Thank you for heeding my request. My heart is calm and filled with confidence that I've followed the will of my God. I would like to reward your bravery. I possess no treasure, but please take this as a token of appreciation. Oh, thank you very much. As far as I know, your next target looks to be the Stag Lord himself. With the Temple of the Elk cleansed of evil, the fog surrounding us should disperse to reveal the path to the Brute's lair. Of course, magic so powerful is unlikely to disappear all at once. Bide your time. Follow up on other concerns while you wait. I will gladly aid you on your noble quest. Erastil himself foresaw our meeting. And do you understand the true meaning of your visions now? I trust in their truth. These visions, they were the voice of Erastil himself, quiet but clear. Before all this happened, I believed Erastil had turned his back to me. But now, I see clearly. He has shown me divine mercy, for he has led me to you and invited me to aid in a fellow priest's deliverance. Lady Serenray and Erastil walk the paths of the gods hand in hand. And so must their servants as well. Tristian is undoubtedly still very young, and youth is a time of naivete and confusion. But I see kindness and strength of spirit in him, traits indispensable to a priest. I sense that all that's transpired thus far is only the beginning, and the future promises great things for Tristian and for you. This is why Arastil led me to the Temple of the Elk. Day and night I pray for you and for my young friend. May the stag god lead you down the true path. Thank you very much, sir. As you wish. Uh, what services do you offer? Alright. Um, where is that orc? Probably inside. Okay, so we have to wait until the fog clears away. Oh, we have radishes. Hello, Bokin! Oh. Uh, we already turned into radishes. Oh, we gotta talk to the wife. Hello, miss! I have your ring! I suppose I should tell you the truth about her. Cressa wasn't her real name. Her real name is Irania. She was the daughter of my mother and her second husband, my half-sister. I can't help but feel everything happened was my fault. She always had a wildness. She wandered the streets, hanging out with the bad crowd until the day she passed. Mother complained about Irania consistently. Back then, it was just cruel games and escapades. She never really hurt anyone back in Restov. Her father didn't much live much longer than our mother, so I decided to help Irania. I brought her here to the Stolen Lands, though Oleg was against it. And once here, she immediately fell under the Stag Lord's influence. She never needed to meet him, and the stories and rumors from the local hunters and bandits were enough to win her over. 
She would tell us how he was a real leader, unlike Rostov's softies. Eventually, she ran away only to return under a new name with a pack of thugs to collect taxes from us. What's worse, she'd participate in the torture and execution of prisoners alongside the Stagler's minions. I don't know if there's any way to set her back on the right path, but I'm grateful for your kindness. Perhaps there's hope. For the sake of my mother's memory, I'd like to believe that. I think I killed her. I'm not gonna tell her that. How cute! Okay, is there anything else that I need to get off my thing? Okay, we have to wait till the fog clears away. We remove them. We have to kill Tusk Hunter. Gutter. Alright. Maybe maybe he's upstairs. This is my time to shine. Hello! So who are you? What do you want? Have a little chat? Alright, let's not like I have nothing better about to do. Um what kind of relationship do you have with Oxy? Oh, tell me about yourself. What is it we are? I was born, I'm alive, I haven't dead yet. Uh, what do your tattoos mean? They're magical. They help me control my powers. They technically gave them to me. I'd hope some that somewhere on my body there's at least one sign left by my tribe, but no. I guess they didn't care to bother to hell with them. They better hope that I never find them. If I ever meet my father, I will even the score with us. Hmm. How did you manage to use both sword and magic and not cut off your fingers? <laughs> it's simple. I'm just bloody good. How, where did you get your magical powers? What magical powers the hell are you talking about? Oh, you mean these? Yes. I've had them since I was born. At least that's one thing I can thank my scum parents for. Maybe these powers are why they sold me to slavery. Think they were scared? Who knows, damn new Marians. What, uh, what deity do you worship? <laughs> I never got much from the gods so far. Uh, but if I if you make me choose, I'd say Callistra, goddess the f goddess of lust and revenge. Who else could I worship? The savored sting, the goddess of fun, pleasure, and revenge. Oh yes. Uh, do you remember your childhood? <sighs> what a crap question. I was just a kid when they sold me. Before, I don't remember much. Smoky fire, stinky hides, always bumping along on a horse. I think I was born in one of those uh, Khalid tribes of Numenera. There are many. Some survive on their own, some give up their pride and serve the Technic League. I guess mine was one of the cowards, if they sold off their own kids. I remember my father's hands. Rough, scarred, white. So, I guess I get the green skin from my mother, but I don't remember her. I think I remember playing with another half-orc child. A brother, maybe. For some reason, they didn't sell him, just me. My father gave him his dagger to play with, never gave it to me. Ugh, I don't want to remember. Forget all this, I'm an orphan. I grew up as a slave, that I remember well. So many things burned into my memory, most of all, I remember her, my Octavia. Um, hey, we are almost the same age, but back then she was twice as young as me, just a child, but a brave one, cunning, bold, beautiful, the most beautiful girl in the world. Uh, thank you for answering my questions. Uh, what's your relationship with Octavia? Well, my Octavia and I don't have a relationship, we have a life together. Ooh, are you and Octavia faithful to each other? Octavia and I are connected. This connection cannot be broken. We grew up into each other, you know? Jealousy is for weak colors. Cowards. Who, do, who don't we trust? Each other are scared of being tricked. If one night the side threatens your love, that means there's no real love to begin with. She and I are together to the end. We will never part from each other. So when she likes some lad or some lass, it's no drama to me. I just ask her where she wants me to leave when they're alone or join in. She does the same. Oh, this is a, a folly relationship, I see. Are you judging this? Or maybe you just want to join our tent? No, 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 no. I'm not here to judge. Just, just curious. Oh, you asked, I answered. When you pry into others' lives, don't surprise if you do. Okay. So long. Don't be shy. Just don't go pale when I answer. All right. Can I take a look at people? All right, so let's see. He is chaotic evil, obviously. Uh, a man.
Magus Eldrassion. I don't know what that means. Okay, we should level you up. Magus. Okay. Interesting. Um, I guess athletics, persuasion, use magical device. And... I guess arcane accuracy? Alright, I get one more spell. I mean, magic missile is always, like, good to have. Alright, so, and then she is... She's a wizard. Okay, she's a straight up wizard. Wizard rogue. Why? She's a multi class wizard rogue? Okay, interesting. She's an arcane trickster. That makes sense. I can actually use one of them. Um, what is your. Okay. I could really use. Okay. Um, oh, you got so many skills. We're gonna put... Tricker- we need a trickery person, to be honest. Bigger sneak attack! And, um... Sure, precise shot, why not? That's good. Yes, evasion. Okay, she is... Okay, interesting. Alright, can I equip you guys with shit? Um, Alright, you use a heavy shield, so we're gonna give you the magical shield. Uh, you use heavy armor. This is light armor. You don't use... Oh, um... Use medium, it looks like. You don't have any. Okay, uh, have this chain shirt. And you, your base stat class is wizard, so you get this pretty helm. Wow, she's got really good stats for like rogue. All right. Um. Can uh, you use swords? Right, you have a scimitar. Um, scimitars, I thought that scimitars are finesse weapons. They're not. Okay. No, you can do a wheel. Okay, let's do that. Um, no, no reason you can't do a wheel. You should definitely have, like, a backup weapon. Okay, there we go. Um, do I have a backup weapon? I should have a backup weapon. I have a crossbow. I have a backup weapon. Do you have a backup weapon? Do you have a backup weapon? Do you need a backup weapon? You can't use those. Okay. You have a backup weapon. You have a backup weapon. You should have this quarter staff. <laughs> Just in case. And you should have a backup weapon. Everybody should have a backup weapon. Like, this is a finesse weapon. What do you mean you can't use it? Fine. Alright. Cool. Alright, I guess we can go do things. Right, 
right, well, quick save, and then we can go get a boar. We can go exploring. Let me think about my makeup now. Definitely need a cleric, for sure. All right. Uh, we don't need two clerics. Um, I love you. Let's take you, and let's try you for size. All right. Because Amira wants to really kill Tusk Gunner. So we're gonna go kill Tusk. When the barbarian who does the most damage on in your party tells you, hey, I want to kill something, you go kill it. All right. Um, let's sneak. Now you see me. Now you don't. Uh... So here we are, the monster's here, and now I'll tear him apart. Just watch me. There's a custom where I am... A boy kills a monster in front of the elders to prove he's a man. Haha, <laughs> that's funny. In our parts, boys must do something rather d different to become men. Shut up, Octavia. In our tribe, girls don't get initiation at all. So I arranged m my trial myself. Like the song about Calgore the orphan. I downed a cave lying in single combat. See? The scars I got from the battle. Do you know what my elders did after I threw the lion skin at their feet? They, uh, they invoked some formality and declared your initiation invalid? I wish! They laughed in my face. They said I scratched my belly myself and hired some man to kill the lion in to trade for ugh. Later they agreed my initiation, of course. They had no choice, but... Must you slay him in single part? Time that it'll take our whole party to bring Tuskether down. You think I can't butcher a pig myself? Though, if the elder saw the beast was about to kill the boy, they would help him. There's no shame in that, but it doesn't matter. I'm just saying, now you stand and watch me getting the beast. Alright, uh, let's go! Gorm, watch. Oh, dear. Maybe we can just heal her? Oh, alright. Well! Listen, I'm not the one that can heal. Uh, five foot step. And then... This won't kill me. Alright, she's not doing very well. Um... I think it's time to help. Like a strike 
is one. Can I heal her? I should enlarge person her. I need he better healing spells. I'll survive. I always survive. Oh boy. I'll fight if I have to. You can't stop me. Okay. I'll cut you. It's a, it was a really big boar, lady. Are you fucking kidding me? yet watch it see me in action I almost chopped his head off that's it trial done no one dare say me Mir or weak you are a valiant warrior where it truly feels to doubt your strength some did you know I spit on it uh, are you hurt Scratches. So, so, still, why did you want to kill this monster? You passed this test back when you were in your tribe, didn't you? Well, not just pups pass this test. If a man is a newcomer to the tribe, he must bring the monster's hide to prove he's not weak. I am honored you consider me part of your new tribe. You are a strong and valiant warrior. Just don't start that. Don't talk to me about honor and valor. I know already. Still, I owe you thanks. You have a true chief's heart. You know what? If I, we meet another monster like this, I'll kill it too. Not just for a test, just that nobody ever day say Amiri isn't a warrior. Okay. We killed. We 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 killed the pig. That is. That's good. That that is very good. You are so young, Tristian, but you've seen so much. It must be hard. Carrying your faith to all the ends of the world. She wants some. Um... Yes, Octavia. It's a heavy burden. Sometimes I doubt I can handle it. But I close my eyes and appeal to the healing light. And I feel the presence of my goddess. And I know, if not me, then who? It is very rainy. Oh. Oh, there's froggies. Okay. We will hide. Unseen. I shall end this suffering. Okay. Uh, I guess they heard us. I could bless too.
Okay, so that was the bonus attack. So that's plus one the bone uh, attacks. Um, you. Attack! Man. Alright, he, so he's holding the spell. I'll fight if I have to. This didn't work. I must be doing it. Uh, the spell's not working. That's mean. It is mean. It is very mean. You forced my hand. Oh, why am I doing this? That ooh. Okay. Tear them apart. Bleed for me. Okay. You can't stop me. I okay, I have something to remove fear or did I not get it on this character? You know what? Let's try it. Try to make this swift. They go down. Really? Fear me. Apparently, that's not being feared. Okay. Still feared. <laughs> Ow. Repent. <laughs> Ow. Bring it. One day. Stay behind me. Yeah, I can't get closer. You forced my hand. Yeah, fear can really mess us up. Thank you. All right, so the source of my fear is finally gone. That's great. 
You can't stop me. Let us strike as one. Giant tower shield, big as a person. Okay, so if we. Eleanor just just rare for us. Please. I'll try to make this swift. They go down. <sighs> I'll cut you. Last one should do it. Nope. You can't hit the broad side of a barn, apparently. So come to this. Many bogards later. Let's go turn in that uh that quest. Somebody's happy that Tough Scudder is gone, hopefully. I assume when like the main quest giver is like do this, you know, it's like on the main path somehow. How cute. All right. Do, 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 do. Hello, I'm back. He's dead. He is dead. That's a heck of a beast. I'd love to have a trophy like that, but the deal's the deal. The head goes to Old Benzin, the bounty goes to you. Awesome. Alright. Uh time to go. This is my time to shine. I'm running away. What do I have on my belt? A lot of wands. Alright. Yeah, I'll 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 stick with the setup. Nobody else has any like companion quests I need to do yet. Oh, this is a place we haven't been before. Uh huh. Probably there are more frogs. There are probably more frogs here. I expect it. All right, there's nothing over here. That is a troll. It is level six. What level are we? Three. It is level eight. Okay, we could try it. There's Two victory. There is only one, right? Okay, uh, bless. Keep on hitting it with the acid splash. I'll cut you. Okay. We have gear light wounds. No! 
That hurt. Acid. Just stop the regeneration. Okay. Pelting it with the acid. Onward. Oh, the acid. Uh, he's fine. This is for you. I'm listening. Yes, yeah, you should heal her. Magritium Turinos. Okay, good. Uh, what did we get? Ooh. Ooh. You were that. You were that. <laughs> Hopefully there is not a Oh, there's some loot over here Ah, where am I going? Okay, uh, we will do more and more exploration next time. Thank you and have a great day. <laughs>